Hello, hello, hello. Hey guys, Brad and Greta with MyBabyCanSleep.com. If your baby is not sleeping, you need to stop and watch this video right now. We're baby sleep consultants. We help moms, dads, families all over the world to get their babies sleeping through the night. We've been featured on major media like Romper and Pregnancy and Newborn Magazine, and our videos have millions of views. You need to stop whether you have a one-day-old, a one-week-old, a one-year-old, a two-year-old. This is going to transform you, your sleep, your marriage, and your child. So we were going to bring you three secrets because these same three things keep popping up when we would talk with hundreds of families, and we're going to give them to you right now. We're going to lay out three secrets of a sleeping baby. So stop, watch, take notes right now. This is going to transform your life. All right, are you All ready? Right. Okay, secret number one, a good night starts with a good day. Yes. Okay, this is like the most neglected secret yeah, there is. Yeah, it's you know, simple. People don't realize what the entirety of the day does for nighttime sleep. You know, yep. there are some misconceptions out there. Um, a lot of people think that Nighttime sleep uh, is just about the half an hour routine before bed. It's mm -hmm. about, you know, the the bath and the bottle and the stories and the lotion and massage and, you know, getting that rice cereal in mm -hmm. or something before bedtime. Um, but it really has a very, very little to do with that half hour routine before bed. And it has everything to do with the entirety of your day. Yes, you have to be set up for success if you want to sleep through the night, which starts during the whole entire mm -hmm. daytime. Another misconception is, you know, I should keep my baby up all day long uh, in hopes that they'll be super, super tired um, for, for nighttime sleep. Yeah, guys, and, don't do that. Yeah, please, like for please sure. don't do that. Uh, yeah. The more sleep baby gets, the more sleep they'll get at night, right? Um, so it's super important that your daytime routine is is spot on. you got yep. to have... Uh, you have to have a routine. You have to have <laughs> consistent naps. You have to have full feedings. You have to have all of these things put together throughout the day to make a great night. Yeah, most people think that we need to let baby choose their schedule. In fact, it's the exact opposite. We have to use our parental wisdom and guidance to help choose the optimal schedule for our babies. Yes. All right. Are you ready for all secret right. number two? Secret number two. Okay. Let's do it. The $1,172 Ooh. sleep mistake and how to avoid it. That's a big number. It's a huge it's a number. It's a huge number. Gotta tell them what that number means. <laughs> yeah, so so many poor parents, when they have their first baby or second baby or third baby, um, they spend so much money on those those really expensive equipment things. The contraptions. You know, the, the, the vibrators and the rockers and the bassinets and the perfect swaddle. Um, you know, they spend so much money on those things. And what those are, they're actually sleep crutches or sleep associations. So um, people, you know, use these to help their baby get to sleep. Mm -hmm. But then the problem is that when baby wakes up prematurely, they need those things to get back to sleep. Yeah. So we actually have to teach our baby the skill of going from fully wide awake to fully asleep without the help of anyone or anything, right? That's the true definition of sleep. If you want to get sleep, you have to know what that definition and definition is, and that is having your baby go from fully wide awake to fully asleep without the help of anyone yeah, or anything. And actually, I, I have to point out that some of the biggest offenders, the biggest crutches, are actually rocking your to baby to sleep or feeding your baby mm -hmm. to sleep, nursing your bottle, and um, a lot and lots of people do this. Uh, it, it might not be free. I mean, the actually the doctor <laughs> bills and the chiropractor bills, you yeah. know. There you that's, go. It's uh, going to add up from all the wear and tear on your body. Well, sure, sure. So. And I, I even read an article where a company is selling uh, a, a, a vibrating chair that mimics the drive of a car, but not even a car like your car. So if you drive a truck, you can set it on truck mode to literally do that. And guys, please don't buy that. It's super expensive, and you absolutely don't need that yeah, in order to get yeah. a good night's sleep you for your baby. You can teach your baby the skill yes. of sleep. Yep, and absolutely. you don't have to buy those contraptions. All yep. Right? All right. Secret number three. Okay. Secret number three. Information alone is not enough. Yes. It is not enough. There are, I don't even know how many hundreds, thousands of books there are on baby oh. sleep. You know, there's blogs and information out there. Um, but the problem is, is that, you know, there might be some good information out there. There might be some bad information out there. But, you know, you can't ask the book a question. You know, the book says, well, you need to do this and you have to be here. Uh, and you might be here, but how do you get from here to here? Yes, absolutely. 80% 
of the fight to get your baby sleeping through the night is about implementation and consistency. Mm -hmm. And it's 20% about information. You have to have good information, but it's it, it would be like going to the bookstore and getting a book on Spanish, reading it, and then expecting to be <laughs> fluid in Spanish, right? It just It just doesn't happen. Right, right. Absolutely. So let me ask you guys a question. Okay, you're tired and you're distraught and you just want your sleep back and you just want your life back and you want your marriage back and you want your bed back and you just want someone to tell you what to do, right? Is that what you guys want? Give me some hearts if that is what you guys want. Well, let, let me ask you a question. How would you like to work directly with us and finally, absolutely, positively get your baby sleeping through the night? How would you like to hire like a personal trainer for the gym, except a personal trainer for your baby. Someone that's there to ask questions to, making sure you're on the right track, teaching you what to do, giving you all the shortcuts and the hacks, making sure that you're doing it consistently, not letting you give up and being there until you actually yep. get and achieve sleep. The, um, the rate of success in our program is pretty much 100%. We have an amazing, course and we'd love to tell you more about it and schedule a next steps call with us okay so you need to go to mybabycansleep.com slash call right now and we want to see if you are a good fit to work with us we have a few spots open to work with Greta and I to get your baby sleeping through the night so if you're serious about actually getting your baby sleeping and your bed back and your life back, you need to go to mybabycansleep.com slash call. You can click on the link above us and below us. It's somewhere here <laughs> um, and schedule a call with us. We'll get on the phone. We'll see if we're a great fit and we can add you as one of our many hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of students that are all sleeping through the night. So guys, don't go one more sleepless night. You can schedule a call with us and the best part is it's absolutely 100% free. You can get on the phone absolutely 100% free with one of us and we are going to get your baby sleeping through the night. Good? All Sound right. good? All right, guys, yes. we will see you on the call.